episode, then you should be doing two things. That's giving God praise and thanking him for waking you up this morning. Because now you got a new opportunity in life. Now you get to tell your loved ones you love them and forgive those that hurt you because God forgave us. Leave nothing unsaid because tomorrow is in promise. So let's be thankful God made a way. It's church life. Hey, you there. Hey, you. I know why you clicked this video. Because you want to become a YouTuber. But we have something in common. Because I do too. But I have no idea what I'm doing. But if you stick around, we're going to learn how to do this thing together. What's going on, beautiful people? I go by the name Church Life. Home of the most inspirational, motivational videos that I'm going to try to be supplying y'all. So as you saw in the thumbnail, well, I'm trying to become a YouTuber. I decided that I want to become a YouTuber, you know what I mean? But I have no idea how to do it, you know? So I've been looking at videos and I've been trying to get tips from other YouTubers and stuff like that, that, that people, you know, like, they, they give you inspiration. They, they, they tell you things of this nature, like how to start your YouTube and how to go about it and what your content gonna be. And most important of all, how is this gonna bring value to someone else? You know what I mean? So like I said, I don't know how to, I don't know how to be a YouTuber, you know, but that's, some, that's something that I always had a passion for. I, that, that's always been a dream of mine, you know. So you click this video because you want to learn how to be a YouTuber. Well, I'm going to do something different. I haven't really seen nobody do what I'm about to try to do. And that's show y'all, that, that's, that's learn as I learn, you know what I'm saying? So so we're going to be vlogging. We're going to be doing things like that. And I just want to be an inspirational YouTuber. I want to show people that you can do something even if you don't know how. But at the same time, you might got a passion for it. You know what I'm saying? One of the things that I learned is that in order to become a YouTuber, you must bring value. Basically, how to find your value, like, you got to figure out what your niche is going to be about. See, my niche is going to be motivation, you know what I'm saying, inspiration, stuff like that, stuff of that nature. But you might be a marketing genius, you know what I'm saying? And you could start a YouTube talking about marketing, talking about different ways to strategize how you're going to put out a video and all that kind of stuff. Or you might you might be tech savvy, you know what I'm saying? You might like like electronics and stuff like that. So So you might deal with... I say like computers, cell phones, anything that got to do with technology. You know what I'm saying? So when you find your niche, when you find your niche and what, what, what you're passionate about, that's what you talk about. But most important of all, you got to be tenacious. You got to be relentless and you got to be what? Yourself. That's what it means to just try. So basically, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. I'm just giving, I'm just giving something a shot. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I don't know if it's going to reach people, you know? Okay, the next thing I learned when becoming a YouTuber, this is what I do. I go to my favorite YouTubers, right? Like Tall Guy Car Reviews and, and people like that, or Love and Slim, and I go to their first video. Like, I go to their oldest video, and I see, I look at their evolution. You know what I'm saying? Like, how they evolve over the years, over the time. And one thing I learned, one thing I noticed with all YouTubers, the one thing I noticed, the common thing that I noticed, is personality you know when you first start off you're gonna be a little bit nervous you're gonna be, be a little bit scared of the camera you know what I'm saying but at the same time you got to realize people don't want to watch a boring video so how, so you gotta think you got to ask yourself how am I gonna make this interesting because it's a lot of people out there doing the same thing that you're trying to do and that I'm trying to do we trying to do this together you feel me so it's a lot of people in the world that's doing vlogs, that's doing YouTube. But let me tell you something. Everybody has a unique personality. All you got to do is be yourself. You know, because even though everybody is doing the same thing, it's only one of you. You did what I'm talking about? So that's what I'm doing. I'm just trying to be myself and I'm trying to show people how to do it and how to get to it. So this, that's what this video is about. I want to become a YouTuber. I have absolutely no experience really whatsoever doing this. And you know, I really don't know what I'm doing. And I'm kind of, I kind of know what I'm talking about. I, I ain't going to lie. I'm going to just keep it real. I'm winging it a little bit. So the first time you start your YouTube videos, this is what I learned. It's going to be a lot of trial and error at the beginning. I promise you. But don't worry about it because the first thing you need to do is just try. Like I said, 
Try for me means be tenacious, relentless, and most important of all, be yourself. Be yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You like how I did it, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was pretty cool. So you got to figure out what you want to talk about. What, and what you want to talk about, that's your niche. And then you got to stick to your niche until until your channel grows. And then once your channel grows, then you can expand. But if, you, if you're going to expand, like if you start your channel off talking about one thing and then, you know, like, like you expand, at least try to figure out ways to keep your, keep your core value of your channel. You know what I'm saying? Keep your core value. So your core value is going to be the niche you started out with. But you got to think about it. Whatever your niche is, like for example, if you if you talking about computers, if you if you talking about electronics, right? You you can go to different places and you know what I'm saying, talk about electronics or you know what I'm saying, you could just do different things. You can um you can show people, you know, like different tools that they can use to start their vlogs, right? Like I said, man, I don't know what I'm talking about, but hey, we're going to give it a shot, right? So you probably wondering, okay, if I'm going to start a YouTube channel and I'm going to start vlogging and I'm going to start talking about different things, you know, and I, I found my niche, I figured out the name of my, my, my YouTube channel, uh, what tools can I use to start this whole process? Well, I don't have a lot of money. I'm pretty broke right now. So what I'm using is my cell phone. That's what I'm using. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm using my cell phone. But I, I did invest in something before I went broke. I did invest in something and I'm gonna show y'all that so this is the tool that I was talking about it's a smooth cube Zion I got it from Best Buy it's built for your cell phone it's a gimbal that's made for your cell phone any smartphone yeah I don't know too much about it but it worked pretty good. That's the power button. And it comes with an app. That's the zoom button. And that's a joystick to control it. Control it, control it. Yeah, man. And that's the turning on right here. That is it right there. Yeah, it also come with this stylus case. The case come with it, and the strap come with it. You know, just in case you want to wear it on your shoulder. You know what I'm saying? Something simple. And it's a good price. It's at a reasonable price. All right, without further ado, let's get back to the video. So the tool, it's, it's a gimbal. It's a gimbal for cell phones, and it's called a Zion Smooth Q. I promise you, it took me at least 10 times to get that right because I can't say those two words together. Smooth, Q. Like, it's hard for me to say those two words together. You know, well, a word and a letter. You, man, you know what I'm talking about. So the tool that I just showed y'all, it's equipped for smartphones. It's equipped for your cell phone. The reason why I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm not using my, I'm not using the tool right now because I wanted to do the video like this, you know, just to start off with. But, you know, in the future, I'm going to use the tool that I got because I want to start vlogging. I want to be a YouTuber, you know, so I, ju I just invested in that. I went to Best Buy to get it, you know what I'm saying? And it cost me probably like, like, like 50 or $70, something around that price range, you know. But that's something that you can get to, you know, start your YouTube channel off with. That's something you can, that's something you can invest in. But like I said, all you got to do is give it a try. Uh, I ran all that again. All, like I said, all you got to do is give it a try. Because you don't know how it's going to turn out. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, the word of the day is tenacious, relentless, and most important of all, be yourself. Try. That's the word of the day. Try. Like I said, my channel was going to be about inspiring people to try to try to do something give it all you have be relentless keep going even if they turn you down and another thing you got to realize another thing you got to realize when you start your youtube channel off don't try to be a people pleaser because it's going to be people that love your channel and it's going to be people that don't like your channel i call it the 50 50 rule 
of being yourself because if everybody like you right if everybody like you then that means you tr you a people pleaser you trying to please the people a hundred percent that's not gonna work because you ain't gonna have no balance you feel me and then if a hundred percent of the people hate you then that means you just being a jerk that's not gonna work so you got to find yourself somewhere in the middle you know what I mean? Because in life, it's always going to be people that like you and it's always going to be people that dislike you. So you just got to be yourself. That's the 50-50 rule for me. You know, you got to be yourself. You got to find that balance. And so that's another thing I'm going to be providing for on this channel. I'm just trying to motivate people to just try. Just try. <laughs> that's the word of the day. Just try. You feel me? <laughs> just try. That's all you got to do, man. I don't want to talk you off today. And we're going to be back with more videos. We're going to come back with some bangers. This is, just, this is just my introduction, you know what I'm saying, to becoming a YouTuber. Like in the thumbnail, let's become a YouTuber. Let's become a YouTuber. We're going to do it together. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm doing, man. But I'm going to try, though. I'm going to at least try. And you can do the same thing. All you need is a cell phone. And if your cell phone got a camera, that's all you need. All cell phones got a camera nowadays. That's all you need. And you know that tool that I told you about, the Zion, the gimbal that I got. You can go to Best Buy. That's the cheapest one I saw in there. And so I invested in that. Because you're going to need that if you want to take it to the next level. And the one I got didn't come with a tripod. So you got to invest in that too. But they also got gimbals for cell phones that got tripods that come with it. So, you know, just go to Best Buy. Go to your friendly neighborhood Best Buy and hey man, that's how you get started. If this video brought you value, just type in try in the comment section. Like, comment, subscribe, do, you know, do all that man. Do, do the whole shebang for me man. Share this video. Do whatever you do man, but whatever you do, be tenacious, relentless, and most important of all, yourself. So whatever you do, just try to be the best you can at it. And you're going to stumble and fall at the beginning, maybe. You know what I mean? Your first video may be a hit. Who knows? But you ain't going to never know if you don't try. But yeah, man, I just want to tell you that when you're starting the YouTube channel, right, one of the things I do know, it's going to be intimidating at first, man. You're going to be terrified. You're going to be intimidated. But don't, don't, don't let that discourage you. Just keep going with it. And eventually you're going to figure it out. You know what I mean? So that's what my channel is going to be about. Just trying to figure out how to be a YouTuber. And I'm trying to show people in live action. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm talking about like just live action. Showing people how to do this thing hands on. Instead of just really talking about it. Showing people hands on how to do this thing. And basically trying to encourage people to not be afraid. Because I don't know how to do this thing neither. So you're not alone. So, we're going to learn together. Let's become a YouTuber. It's church life.